Hello, we're on our way to Cantlever Park as Ronson Town face off against Stafford Rangers. A win today for Paul Cardin's side would mean that they'll remain top of the table, whereas a victory for Stafford Rangers would mean that they won't slip into the relegation zone. Should be a good game. Let's go. So Josh Stafford, 19th place. We shouldn't take them for granted because you know it's kind of a difficult league. What's your thoughts on the game? Yeah, you can't take anyone for granted in this league. Um, it's two teams fighting for two different reasons. You know, Stafford and 19th, they're fighting for their place in the Evo Stick Pre Northern Premier League and Warrington at the other side fighting for promotion. So you, you can't take them easy today. You, you know, you can get anything in this league. Cardin says every game is the important game. So yeah, no, nothing's easy. You, you can't just accept the three points right. easily here. And obviously Amis not starting, you know, you know, he's been in great form. Do you think that would be a problem going into this game? Um, you know, he's been, he has been in great form. I think he's on 14 goals or something like that yeah, now this season. Yeah. Uh, he's, he's, he is a big loss to the side, but you know, they've got other big names, like Bowen Dixon. Exactly. They've got Jack McCraft back from injury. Uh, Jack Dunn looked like he was doing an injury test, but I don't think he's on the team sheet, is he? Um, yeah. So they do have some big names that can stand in, like Dylan Maslow, who, who scored last week. So, you know, he's a big loss, but they've got big names that can come in and cover him. That should be a good game. Thank you. Welcome to my universe, babe. Where the stars they align. When I see your face, it might be an uphill battle in the second half. What's your thoughts? Yeah, it's going to be an uphill battle now. Uh, Bowen Dixon put put the, uh, the the yellows in the lead. The uh, Dylan Baslow cross and Mark Roberts did well to keep it in the field of play and sort of landed to Bowen Dixon who headed it for the, for the lead and then. Captain Luke Jones it was, who equalised minutes before the half. It's going to be a tough one with just 10 men and a few yellow cards. I think the referee's a bit, yeah, bit card happy. a bit uh, card friendly at the moment, but hopefully, you know, we've shown it countless times throughout the season that we can come back and hopefully go all three points. Yeah. Give me your happiness for sure. Welcome to my universe. So Josh, a disappointing 3-2 loss. Uh, not what we needed if you want to get that title push, but, you know, I felt like we had a good um, end to the game, but just wasn't really enough. Of it. Yeah, Marcus Kusali scoring his first goal for it in town. Looked like there could be a late comeback. There was a, a cross in for Baslow in the end, and Ambis cut his head on the end of it, but keeper got down low and quick, and he, and he saved the chance. You know, it's a bit of a heartbreak, but, you know, there's eight games left and every, every chance for the title. Solo que se...